All right. Let's check this out. I'm going to play this whole thing here. Caca! Caca! Rawr. It's all cool. All pretty cool. All right. Okay. This is all very cool. I'm very clear. Let's see your camera. Uh, at one point, I can ask you if you give me your scene. I can do some camera work. Uh, I, I will probably reframe this so it's not so... Um, what's the word? Edgy. <laughs> um, you know, that the head will be maybe here. We can easily reframe. I think this would be really cool to do some handheld camera all the way up to kind of here-ish. And then kind of calm it down. This is all great. You're just doing a, a rotate and reframe. And this is cool too. We can potentially even kind of reframe up um actually just send me send me your maya scene uh and just do a reference you know all the reference scenes or just import all the references uh then i can just do a quick path because i don't think it would be anything different so that you have to adjust your animation it'd just be a general path that you can render through but i would still look at your arcs and everything on a camera with no handheld because otherwise uh, that kind of defeats the purpose of the handheld other than that, I think this is all cool. The timing is cool. We look at the kit first. See this. I will probably speed things up a bit here. To get some, it doesn't get too slow. This is cool because we see this. This comes in. We're fully engaged. It'll... That was my computer freezing. Weird. Uh, so lands here. Spavon, spavon, goes forward. And then does a... Rawr. Now... I'm not sure how much human stuff you want to put in, in terms of, you know, like it starts already to take a sidestep, so like crossing legs almost, while the head still looks, looks over there. It's like, okay, I'm going to go over there, but I'm still making sure that I'm growling and yelling at you because you're turd, um, which might get too cre uh, too humany maybe, but it could be something worth exploring as you do your, your steps there, which are cool. Maybe you can explore, it shouldn't be too much, you kind of block it out quickly or do two versions. Um, to see how that feels. Body goes first, but the head lingers. And then here I would do this, and then the way you have it here, right through there, you could have a little bit of a pause with this in the air. So it does a step, step, pause, like here, moving, hold, examining, oh no, and then a bit faster, and then a slower step here. This is all cute. That's great. Actually, it already looks great. Home with the timing of this and everything. Just gonna incorporate a little bit of the body mechanics through this in your in your blocking plus polish. And then you can probably with the parent there goes up. And I would do up, hold a bit with almost no movement, and then a bit slower and then faster. Because right now you're going up, 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 and it feels all very kind of even and then yelling. So just acting wise it could be. This goes back a bit, realizes, oh crap, that's it. And then, rah, that's kind of the timing uh, that I would have. All right, that is kind of it. Um, you're mentioning this is still rough, but now you want to get into the nitty gritty, totally fine. Um, so it's a short critique, just kind of confirming what you have is totally fine. Now let's get fully into the animation nitty gritty. All right. Thank you. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.